Welcome to Midwest Hunting and Outdoors by Two Dumb Asses. In this episode, we're going to be talking about invasive species, specifically poison hemlock. Stay tuned. Hi, this is Tim and Dole. Welcome to Midwest Hunting and Outdoors by Two Dumb Asses, a podcast about the outdoors, hunting, and being a steward of the land. Welcome to Midwest Hunting and Outdoors by Two Dumb Asses. Today's episode's about poison hemlock. Uh, and what you see here is I've got an abundance of it and this is nothing compared to uh, what we had prior to this and what you'll do is you'll find this in roadsides ditches uh, around along creek beds etc this this stuff is highly invasive and uh, it was originally brought in from Europe uh, for its decorative nature and people would put it into its landscaping and most invasive species that, that came in the United States that are that are they're pretty like this that's exactly how they did you know like honeysuckle it was brought in as a decorative bush and uh, now it's very invasive and so what you have is these seeds these seeds actually start to form right here along each of these trunks and if you were to mow these it's just going to scatter this everywhere so it's related to wild parsnip which is highly poisonous uh, it's really related to queen anne's lace and also wild carrot but again, this is highly poisonous. Just want to reiterate that. Um, it blooms from kind of May to August. May to August, it's a biennial plant. So a biennial plant meaning that, hey, every other year it's going to be coming up. And But what it does is it forms a rosette, which is like a little bit of a ground cover. And you, you don't see any of it here because we've been kind of, well, there is a little bit of it over here. But we've been actually tr killing this for this is our third year now and uh, we had to kill a bunch and it's just a multi-year process of trying to kill this stuff so we'll get a couple close-ups to show you how to identify this but it's very very important you don't mow it uh, and then uh, also make sure you're wearing gloves when you're handling it and also like protective gear I know I'm in a short sleeve shirt and I'm going to do some things to make sure it doesn't touch me um, but then once you're done handling this, make sure you wash your clothing, any equipment you used, as well as uh, your body. So one of the things you'll see with this hemlock is right through here, it's got kind of a purple specked uh, stalk and it'll be all the way up. And that's a good indicator of, uh, of hemlock, that it's hemlock. So not Queen Anne's Lace. Queen Anne's Lace, and we'll show you pictures of Queen Anne's Lace a little later. It uh, looks very similar, but uh, has some also very subtle differences. But again, be safe. Be safe, don't let this touch you. Um, don't mow it. Best thing, glyphosate. Glyphosate will be your solution on killing this. And I'll show you some of, some of the work that we've done to try to eliminate try to eliminate uh, this species from our property but then that's it if you have any questions comments drop us a line email email or a comment and we'll get back to you but until next time be safe have fun and get outdoors thanks for listening or watching our show we have some exciting topics and guests coming up we ask that you subscribe to our channel on YouTube and follow us on Twitter Instagram and Facebook we look forward to hearing your suggestions for topics, questions, and comments. This is Two Dumb Asses signing off. Until next time, be, be safe, safe, have, have fun, fun, and, and get, get outdoors. outdoors.